March by K.C. Kelly, illustrated by Bob Ostrom. How did March get its name? What are some famous holidays celebrated during this month? Were any famous people born in March? Hmm, let's read to find out. This book has a table of contents that lets us know that it is a nonfiction book. Welcome to March. Goodbye winter, hello spring. March is the month when winter ends. Spring begins on March 20th. Flowers bloom and birds fill the trees. In March, many farmers start planting crops. This calendar shows that March is the third month of the year and it has 31 days. So how did March get its name? March is named for the Roman god of war, Mars. We get the names of all the months from the ancient Romans. March was actually the first month of the year in their calendar. Names of months come from other gods, from real people, and from numbers. Ba and Roar. March comes in like a lion and goes out like a lamb. That's an old folk saying. That means the weather in early March is often stormy. The weather in late March is much better. First stone. Each month has a stone linked to it. People who have birthdays in that month call it their birthstone. For March, it's aquamarine. March around the world. Here is the name of this month in other languages. In Chinese, it's San Yue. In Dutch, it's Mart. In English, of course, it's March. In French, it's Mars. In German, it's Der Mars. In Italian, it's Marso. In Japanese, it's Sengatsu. In Spanish, they also call it Marso. And in Swahili, it is Machai. This is winter turns into spring. In March, the seasons officially change. Winter becomes spring on the spring equinox. This word means equal night. On March 20th or 21st, the sun is right above the equator. Day and night are the same length. As spring moves on, days become longer and nights become shorter. Big March Holidays St. Patrick's Day, March 17th More than 1,600 years ago, a boy named Patrick was kidnapped from England and taken to Ireland. He was held for six years. During that time, he became a Christian. He escaped from Ireland but later returned to tell the people about what he had learned. Irish people around the world now celebrate his memory on March 17th. It says, hello birds. Every March 19th, people gather near a church in San Juan Capistrano, California. For hundreds of years, they have watched the skies on that day. Each year, the swallows return. The birds swoop into the small town every year. They build their nests on and around the church building. International Women's Day, March 8th. For hundreds of years, women were not allowed to vote or own property. Many people, men and women, began to feel that that was not right. In the early 1900s, women began to demand their rights. In 1909, the first Women's Day was held to help that cause. The next year, it spread to other countries and has been ever since. March Madness. Basketball fans go crazy during March. American college basketball tournaments are played this month. 
millions of fans watch games every day. They cheer for their favorite schools and players. The final game is often held in April, but the tournament is known as March Madness. Fun March Days. March has more ways to celebrate than just picking four-leafed clovers on St. Patrick's Day. Here are some of the unusual holidays you can enjoy in March. March 1st is National Peanut Butter Lovers Day. Hmm, sounds like a great day to grab a Reese's or a classic peanut butter and jelly sandwich. March 6th is National Dentist Day. March 10th is International Day of Awesomeness. March 11th is Johnny Appleseed Day. March 14th is National Potato Chip Day. March 23rd, National Puppy Day. March 25th is Waffle Day. And March 30th is National Doctors Day. March weeks and months. Holidays don't just mean days. You can celebrate for a week too. You can also have fun all month long. Find out about these ways to enjoy March. Some March weeks. National Bubble Week. This holiday was started by a company that makes bubbles. But so what? It's fun to blow bubbles any week of the year. National Cheerleading Week. In the first full week of March, celebrate students who help others get excited. Thousands of young people take part in cheerleading for their schools. American Chocolate Week. Looking for a good deal on this sweet stuff? In the third week of March, many candy stores have special deals on chocolate. March months. National Red Cross Month. The Red Cross was founded in 1881 by American nurse Clara Barton. The group started out helping wounded soldiers. Today, it helps in disasters around the world. Women's History Month. Along with International Women's Day, celebrate the great things women have done in history, or should we say her story. Music in our schools month. For many people, music is a big part of their lives. Schools are a great way to learn music. Concerts and events this month encourage students to study music. And National Umbrella Month. Well, it does rain a lot in March. March around the world. Countries around the world celebrate in March. Find these countries on the map. Then read about how people there have fun in March. March 9th, Barren Bliss Day in Belize. A sailor from Portugal visited this Central American country in 1926. He fell in love with it. And when he died, he left the country a lot of money. This day says, thanks, Baron. March 12th, Youth Day in Zambia. This African country is one of many to celebrate this day, honoring its young people with festivals and concerts. March 11th, Day of Restoration of Independence in Lithuania. On this day in 1990, Lithuania became the first country to break away from the Soviet Union. March 25th, Greek National Day in Cyprus. This island in the Mediterranean Sea split from Great Britain officially on this day in 1960. A Colorful Festival. During the days around the full moon end of March, 
Hindu people in India and elsewhere celebrate Holi, known as the Festival of Colors. It welcomes spring. People fling colored powder all over themselves and others. Sounds super fun. March in History March 1st, 1872. Yellowstone becomes the first national park in the world. Today, the U.S. has more than 400 national parks and other protected areas. Hundreds more are located around the world. March 2nd, 1962. Will Chamberlain of the Philadelphia 76ers scored 100 points in an NBA game. That's still the most ever scored by one player. March 10th, 1876. Alexander Graham Bell made the first telephone call. He called to his assistant, Mr. Watson, come here. I want to see you. March 11th, 1931. Work on the Hoover Dam began. Later, standing more than 726 feet tall, the dam helps Western states have electricity. In March 12, 1912, Juliet Lowe founded the Girl Scouts. It says the Ides of March. Julius Caesar was a leader in ancient Rome. Some did not want him to be a leader. In 44 BCE, on March 15, known as the Ides, or middle, of March, Caesar was killed. Today, People still say, beware of the Ides of March. March 18th, 1965. Soviet cosmonaut Alexei Leonov became the first person to walk in space. On March 20th, 1999, Brian Jones and Bertrand Picard landed their huge balloon. They had just finished the first round the world balloon fight. March 31st, 1889. The Eiffel Tower opened to the public in Paris, France. It says new states. Five states first joined the United States in March. Do you live in any of these? If you do, make sure and say happy birthday to your state. Nebraska was added in March 1st, 1867. Ohio was added in March 1st, 1803. Florida was added in March 3rd, 1845. Vermont was added on March 4th, 1791. And Maine was added on March 15th in the year 1820. Famous birthdays in March. March 2nd, Dr. Seuss. In March, this writer was born. To celebrate, go toot a horn. On March 3rd, Alexander Graham Bell. This scientist and inventor invented the telephone. March 6th is the birthday of Shaquille O'Neal. The only thing bigger than this NBA great was his list of nicknames. Shaq Daddy, Shaq Fu, The Big Aristotle, Diesel, The Real Deal, and more. March 14th, Albert Einstein. This German scientist created a new way to think about space and time. March 15th, Ruth Bader Ginsburg. She joined the U.S. Supreme Court in 1993. Unfortunately, Ms. Ruth Bader Ginsburg just passed away in 2020. March 24th, Peyton Manning. Manning was already an NFL superstar before he came back from a neck injury to join the Denver Broncos in 2012. March 27th, Mariah Carey. This superstar singer and entertainer hit it big in 1990 with her first album. She's been very popular ever since. 